seven. Harley Davidson, ultra classic, screaming eagle. That's a nice bike. Thank you. And do you ride with a crew? I ride with a group called Zodiacs. Okay. Where are you out of? Uh, I'm out of Waterloo, Iowa. I'm originally out of Omaha, Nebraska. Oh, cool. I'm going to take a look at this bike. How long have you had it? Uh, yes. In 07, I bought it in 08. And the guys that you ride with, are they, um, are they people that you've been riding with for a while? Yeah. I'm the president of my club. Okay. These are my club members here. Okay, awesome. And you're rolling with? Zodiac. Zodiac. These are our brother the colors. There's Zodiacs all across the country. Oh, okay. Those are all of the, all the Zodiac signs. And I'm sorry, I forgot your name Baby again. Doll. Baby doll. Baby, Baby doll. doll. Yes. Okay, most people in the biker world know the devil. And they know him by that name. That's, our, that's his biker name. Um, he's been riding since 1974. Is that right? Oh, wow. 1974. And the thing I was just telling these guys, we usually... When we ride, we ride. We never put our bike on the trailer and go to our destination. Mm -hmm. For instance, we just come back from the um, National Biker Roundup in Tunica, Mississippi. And yeah, in Tunica. <laughs> <laughs> and um, we rode our bikes from the state of Iowa, Minnesota, Iowa, and we were, rode our bikes to Mississippi. Oh, wow. Uh, and now we're headed back home. What's the longest trip that you've taken? Uh, my longest trip uh, in 01, Roundup was in Madera, California. I went from St. Paul, Minnesota to Madera, California. And is that the longest by miles or days or both? Both. Wow. How, how many days? Uh, it took me two days. Oh, okay. And then a couple of years later, it was in Dinwiddie, Virginia. I went from Minnesota to Dinwiddie, Virginia. What causes you to stop mostly, the weather? Uh, when I get tired. When you get tired? Okay. Yeah. Yeah. And I don't like riding at night. I hit a deer in uh, oh, man. Oh, damn. 91 that riding at night. And I've done that before, on, but on four wheels. I couldn't <laughs> imagine doing it on two. Yeah. yeah, I hit a deer back then. And oh, you hit one of those and you can live to tell about it. <laughs> You're here for a you reason. You have the head at home. <laughs> oh, wow. Really? Oh, yeah. Oh, wow. Oh, yeah. I went back the next day and to the accident scene and found a deer and had some venison burgers. Put him in the truck <laughs> and took him to the taxidermy and had the head mounted. Oh wow! Oh man! All right. Well, I wasn't around in '91. <laughs> <laughs> NationalRoundup.com. They have a website also. Okay, definitely. Okay. They give you the history as far as the roundup is concerned. Right, right. And this is our 37. Our 37. 36 annual. Oh, okay. They have it every year. It's a year. Before. It goes on uh, a month before, a week before Sturgis. And uh, Roundup changes states every year. Yeah. It's never in the same state every year. Next year, it is held at the same time in Tulsa, Oklahoma. We're going to be in Tulsa, Oklahoma next year. Okay. Safe trip. Thank you for taking a few minutes to talk to us today.